In this video, you will see the advanced mode of My Design Center, which is a small portion of the My Design Snap app. This is the app icon right here. I'm going to open up the app, and you can see My Design Center is the middle icon. Snap Capture with Frame for Pattern Editing. That means we're going to capture what's in the frame and be able to add our details or add fills, whatever we choose. So when I open this up, it always opens up into easy mode, but you will see advanced mode. So we touch advanced and then it tells you you need to affix the embroidery positioning sticker. Now we're in my design center, so it's not for positioning the embroidery design, but you still need to use that sticker. So that's why it's labeled that way. So what they want you to do is have your fabric hooped. And this is what we're going to work with in this video. And the idea is you can draw or add details to anywhere on the hoop. If you're in easy mode, then if you're going to draw and add details to the center, you're just fine. You want to go to advanced mode when you're going to add details to the outside areas, or in other words, off center to anywhere in this hoop. So if you want to add details to this leaf down at the bottom or leaves up here at the top, you want to put the sticker where you want to add details. So if we want to add veins into this leaf, you'd want to put the snowman positioning marker sticker up there. So that's exactly what we'll do. You receive a sheet of snowman markers, so you have plenty to work with. You simply take one off the sheet and you put it in the area where you're going to add your details. So I'm just going to put it here in the middle of that leaf. You don't have to worry about which direction or how this is just where we're going to add details into that leaf. So I have the marker there. And I'll back on our phone or device, whichever one you're using. So now it's telling us we have the sticker. We do have it there. So now we're going to touch the word. Okay. And at this point, the device tells you to hold it above the frame. So that's what you do. You hold your device above. I like to start low and come high. When it tells you to hold, you just hold still, check. It tells you send to the machine. And you can see that the icon is captured in the picture. You simply touch the word send to the machine. It tells you sending. And then it tells you that it sent it to the machine. You touch OK. It returns to the opening screen of my design snap. Now you're going to return to the machine screen. We're going to touch the screen to wake up the screensaver. We're going to go to my design center because that's the category we're in. At this time, we need to load the image that we put in here. So up here is your load screen. We're in this here where the LAN is sending it. So we're going to go to the wireless icon. And the last picture you put in is always the top line. So simply select this one. And you'll see that your image will display over on the left and it does tell you advanced mode. So you know that you are in the right one. You touch set. We need to attach the frame. And we're going to touch the word OK in the bottom right hand corner. Carriage is going to move. And what happens is it moves to where the sticker is on the project. An LED pointer light turns on and it's shining down onto the dot that's in the center of the large circle. Now you can visually see the LED pointer light is not exactly on the dot that's in the center. So you use the movement tools on your screen and you just touch it and they're very small increments. Just move it so that red LED pointer is precisely on the dot. And when you're there, you're going to touch the word OK in the bottom right hand corner of your screen. Now all you're doing at this point is alignment. You're calibrating that area of the hoop so that when we get to my design center and have the tools there, when you draw or add details, it will be calibrated to that portion of the hoop. So we're going to touch OK in the bottom right hand corner. And here is the entire hoop area. You can see the snowman positioning marker here. If you want to see it more vibrant, you have tools at the bottom. These are your tools here. You simply touch this and you can see it become more and more vibrant. There's our snowman sticker. So we know up here is where the screen is calibrated. Now I'm going to fade it back out because I want to see what I'm adding. Now here's a pencil tool. I choose my pencil and now I could come over here and actually draw veins, details, whatever it is I want to add in that leaf 
and I know now that it's been calibrated so then when we go stitch this it will actually be stitched correctly in that leaf. So that's the reason why I use the sticker to get this precise. Now if I want to do it again and do leaves down at the bottom I would do this all over again. I would get my snowman marker, I would put it on a leaf down at the bottom, recapture the image, and then add details down here to this portion of the design because all it's doing is calibrating the screen to the project that's in your hoop. And you can carry on and fill in as many details as you'd like using the tools of your My Design Center. When you're completed, you simply touch Next and you can preview whatever it is you added and make your, all your changes with your tools. Here's your adjustments. Touch your word preview. Save it if you'd like or not. Touch OK and it goes right into the embroidery part. That's what would stitch out for what I added just right now, but obviously you can go return and change it wherever you like. When you touch set, it takes you to the embroidery screen. You keep touching OK and it takes you right to the embroidery and you can see how it is now precisely lined up correctly with the project that you have in your hoop. You touch embroidery, load it up with your thread, touch go and it will stitch right exactly where you wanted it to be.